Stone Lake Elementary School telling parents to keep an eye out after one student was diagnosed with scarlet fever. The one student that was affected was in the lower levels. The district working quickly to clean the school because scarlet fever is contagious. We uh, let our custodial crew know, uh, maintenance crew know to go in and clean uh, the classrooms or the area that might have been affected. The student homesick since the weekend. We sat down with Dr. Sage Timberline with UC Davis Children's Hospital. It's very rare, yeah, um, but it does happen. Timberline says the disease is essentially strep throat that develops into scarlet fever. The telltale sign, a full body rash. A bright red rash and it has a sandpapery rough kind of feeling, sort of like uh, goosebumps. Much like the flu, there are different strains of strep throat every season, and some strains pose an increased risk for developing into scarlet fever. Decades ago, the disease was deadly. Now, these days it's actually very treatable. Treatable? and preventable. The disease spreads through contact with fluids from the nose or throat, which is why the school is highlighting Global Hand Washing Day next month. Year round two, we're using preventative measures um, by tell, you know, reminding students, reminding parents about hand washing and, hand, and good hand washing procedures. Scarlet fever is treated with antibiotics and there's no vaccine for the disease. The sick student is recovering and was not hospitalized. The district's health coordinator says six students can come back to school after taking medication for 24 hours and no fever. We have to have a clearance from the physician, a note um, stating when they can return. Um, and of course, with that, making sure they started antibiotic treatment. Out of the over 700 students that go to this school, there has only been one confirmed report of the disease, though it can take up to five days for symptoms to show. And if you or your child possibly has the disease, doctors can confirm with a throat swab. Live in Elk Grove, Marley Martinez, KCRA 3 News. Yeah, so rare, but mm. serious. Okay, thanks, Marley.